Hi guys and welcome back on GSM ABC YouTube channel. In uh, this video I will show you how to transfer, backup and uh, manage all your Android content with uh, any trans application. So let's do it. So first thing that you must do is to go on uh, any uh, trans uh, application uh, website and uh, this application is made by iMobile and uh, from here you can download uh, the application for Android or for iPhone and uh, also you have the option to download this for Windows or for Mac. Okay, so after you do that and uh, install your application on your PC, just uh, open the application and uh, you must connect uh, your phone to your PC with a micro USB data cable. I will connect uh, my Android phone to the PC and uh, you must uh, wait a few seconds. I will put this window in the side, okay? And uh, now uh, you must uh, follow the instruction, okay? Um, first, uh, you must open USB debugging to connect Samsung Android uh, device, okay? Uh, to do that, just uh, swipe on your phone and go to apps, settings, and uh, Let's search for USB debugging. I think it's here in advanced settings. Okay. And here you must turn on the advanced settings. Hit OK and check USB debugging and hit OK. Now wait a few seconds. And now as you can see device is connected. I hope you see it on my phone and uh, you can choose a shortcut below to have a quick start. Now let's uh, hit content to PC and uh, from here you can choose what uh, do you want to uh, backup on your PC. Let's uh, see uh, music, photo library and uh, contacts and now uh, select uh, the export path okay, uh, to my documents and now transferring to PC and uh, please wait. Now transferring the music, the photo library And uh, the transfer is complete. You can view files. Let's see my files. And here is the folder. And here there are the contacts. Let's see. Yes, these are my contacts. Okay. And uh, let's see the photo library. And yes, uh, here there are my photos and uh, let's see the music, yes, this is the music from my uh, phone. Now let's go back and uh, let's close this and uh, also here we have an uh, option to clone device and uh, for this you must connect uh, at least two Android devices to continue. Uh, we have the option to add content uh, from your uh, PC. Let's select a an, uh, fi uh, music file, open and uh, just send uh, this file to your phone. It is very easy. Okay. Uh, we have uh, the option uh, to content to device. Uh, again, uh, you must connect at least two Android devices to continue and uh, also you can explore the files from your phone from this uh, application. Okay, now uh, 
from here uh, you can uh, choose a category below to manage your Android uh, content. Uh, let's see. If you can delete the pictures. It is very easy. Just select and hit on the delete. Or <coughs> you can uh, back up to your PC. Or uh, you can uh, send it to other device. Okay. Uh, you can manage uh, the contacts. Uh, you can uh, manage also the music. Now let's move on. Uh, in the top bar we have an Android mover, and uh, from here you can. Uh, move your data from iPhone to Android. So first I will connect my iPhone and wait a few seconds. Okay, and uh, now let's connect uh, Android phone. And now select what do you want to move from iPhone to Samsung. I will uh, check this uh, camera roll and uh, I have here five pictures and just hit on this arrow. Now analyzing files and uh, transferring the photo library from iPhone to Samsung. It is very very easy. So EOS content transition is completed. Okay, and uh, the last uh, option uh, that you have in this application is Media Downloader. And from here you can download online videos or audios to Android device or computer. Just uh, go online and uh, copy here the link and hit download. If you want to download the application and enjoy it, uh, just uh, hit the link from the description of this video. And uh, I hope to enjoy it and uh, see you to the next tutorial. Have a nice day!